Good morning. What's going on everyone? First video of 2024 and I have officially kicked off my photo, photo? photo shoot prep. Um, I am just over a week into it now. So I started last Wednesday, Wednesday the 3rd. Um, today it is Thursday the 11th and I am, uh, I woke up this morning at 1.6 kilos down um, in just over a week, which <laughs> is just a little bit mad. Um, obviously the, the plan is not to drop 1.6 kilos a week for five months, um, which is how long me and my coach, Paul Standell, think this prep is probably gonna be about five months. So. We're shooting for that sort of target, um, but obviously I've dropped from, well, I was tracking 2,700 calories a day on my bulk, but I also had Christmas as well. And then I've just dived straight into my prep where my calories are. So we are on 1,975 calories, and that is training and non-training day, so both exactly the same. Uh, my protein at, uh, is at 151, carbs at 195, and fat at 66 grams. I have a step target of 10,000 a day, which, to be honest with you, is not really that difficult. Prior to this, I or the whole of last year, I set myself a step target of a minimum of 8,000 a day. But there were some days where I'd just completely go over that anyway. So that's not been too difficult. Training four days a week still. I've got push, pull, lower, upper. Today I've got push. And that's all going really well. And what was the other thing? Oh yeah, cardio. Cardio at the minute, I haven't been like programmed any cardio. Um, last year I obviously did a session of cardio a week just from like the point of view of health. So I'm allowed to you know keep that up if I want to. I chose for the first week not to do any cardio because I was just kind of finding my feet with the new plan as it was set. So I didn't want to give myself a million other things to do as well. I've got a check-in today with Paul, so my first one. So I'm going to see what he says in that. He might put in some cardio for me. If not, then this week I'll go back to doing one session a week, just you know, again for the, the point of view of health. But I'm sure as we dive deeper into the prep, he will add in some cardio himself. So today is not really going to be any kind of video in particular. I did think about doing maybe like a full day of eating, but I did one of those on my Instagram the other day, so I didn't want to just redo it again. So this video is literally just going to be a vlog. You guys are going to be following me around. Today I've got push. I've got to eat my food, obviously. Starting off with oats. So I've got 40 grams of oats, 150 ml of semi-skim milk, 30 grams, which is one scoop of the Perform Carrot Cake Whey, which is one of the best ways I've ever tasted. So I've made that into like a sludge, mixed it in, and then just topped it off with some frozen blueberries. So that is gonna be my meal one. I think I'm gonna train earlier today. I think I'm gonna use this as my pre-workout meal. So then we'll go hit push. I've got plenty of work to do, plenty of my own check-ins to be running with people. And I think this evening, all being well, I'm gonna put my feet up at the cinema but we'll see if I manage to get there. I always book the cinema for like evenings in, in the week and then just end up not getting there because I just keep on working. Um, so we'll see how that goes. So yeah, 1.6 kilos down, just over a week in. I mean, I don't really think I could have asked for a, a better start really. Eight aside to move into week two. So let's just go over training quickly. Best born, baby. Had it in a JD bag, fuck a duffel, yeah. Yeah. yeah We just broke down the pack, now we're going through the rubble, yeah, yeah. Listen in comfy shit, I keep it so subtle, yeah, yeah. More time in the tracksuit, in the boot, I got a couple I say how it is, this ain't blues clues Some people are giving the blues clues I'm staying focused, the paper is piling I'm going through the years with a postal I'm always around, man, I'm local See the same faces, no socials Bitch, you gotta hit me with a vocal I told the pipe down, I'm always solo She's in a nightgown, I'm wearing polo Like I play polo She's looking fabulous, told her I'm low, so I got the funds for nine Kojo. She's taking free straps, no Addy, that's this is Coco, yeah. And when I say Coco, I do not mean any Coco Chanel. I get me a packet and break up my friends. I do it again and again and again. I got me some curses, but blessings are sin. I've got me some real ones that sit in the pen. So every day I gotta get me a pen. I write a 16 and I write to my friends, yeah. Pay him a visit.
visit, I step into hell. I pay him a visit, I step into hell. Had it hell. all on the line, lost yeah. all hope, broke down a pack, now I'm counting loads. Hard times, you don't see no one. Throw it home till the reload's done. Look at the wrist, stepped in young, rich and lit. And loving the groupie, step on Sloan, I'm loving the Gucci. Brand new whap, I'm loving the new piece. Yeah. Had it in a JD bag, fuck a duffel, yeah. Yeah. We just broke down the pack, now I'm going through the rubble, yeah. Dressing in comfy shit, I keep it so subtle, yeah. I don't need no help, none. You can see yourself. Look at the kid, my diamonds lit and my trap speaks for itself. And I heard they're stuck on a block. My Cubans flooded with rocks. I never had piss, had to take a risk, hit stoves and fuck up a pot. I lost all hope, then I got rich. Talking money, count me in. I feel myself, can't help but smile. Last month I counted a hundred quid. She's up in Gucci, I'm in the band though. I break a pack and feel like Pablo. Don't ask me what is my angle. I'm busy whipping a brick in my sandals. I got no love. In the streets, there ain't no hugs. I went hard as a little you, and nothing's changed now. I've grown up. Them old niggas talk old shit, but Slim ain't into the politics. I like cute ones with a pretty face and getting top in a foreign whip. Tell me something I don't know. Just tell me. If they ain't on it, then Slim's doing it solo. On my own. They talk a lot, but that trap phone is so slow. Dead. I call that no hope. None. I used to wear polo, now it's Louis V. Can't call my phone for a two Had of it each. all on the line. Con. Lost all hope. Broke down a pack, now I'm counting loads. Hard times, you don't see no one Throw it home till the reload's done Look at the wrist, stepped in young, rich and lit And loving the groupie, step on Sloan I'm loving the Gucci, brand new whap I'm loving the new piece Yeah, had it in a JD bag, fuck a duffel, yeah Yeah, we just broke down the pack Now going through the rubble, yeah Dressing in comfy shit, I keep it so subtle, yeah More time in the tracksuit, in the boot I got a couple, yeah Had it in a JD bag, fuck a duffel, yeah we just broke down the pack, now we're going through the rubble, yeah. Dressing in comfy shit, I keep it so subtle, yeah. Back from the gym. Push, done, did a little bit of abs as well. Um, wasn't the best session. Probably give it, I have to rate it on my um, sheet for my coach. Probably give it like a three out of five. There was a few lifts in there that, I don't know why, they just didn't, um, they didn't move in weight. It was a bit weird, but anyway, still pretty good regardless. So I'm going to have a post-workout meal now. We're going to have a salad, delicious, with um, basically just trying to pile in as much sort of veg, salad and whatnot as I can because I'm just trying to fill up as much as I can. Um, so we're going to have lettuce, cucumber, beetroot, sweet corn, some cheddar cheese and some mayo and then I'll probably also throw in a protein yogurt as well for the post-workout protein sauce. Also, um, when I ordered my carrot cake perform the other day which is this one and it is to die for basically any perform is good um but the, the carrot cake one is very good they sent me out a sample not gonna lie to you i was sort of hoping that it was going to be a pre-workout sample and it's actually just some hydration formula from conte sports so i'm going to just throw this in now I mean, I'm never going to buy it and I'm not going to really feel much benefit from this one serving, but I've got it, so I'm going to throw it in. Um, and then I'm going to get on with some more work because I have got more check-ins to do. Look at that. Okay, so I'm going to eat this. Um, the workout clips that you saw were obviously from today's session. Didn't manage to get every single exercise filmed. Um, every time I tried to use a bit of kit for using to prop my camera up on someone uh, wanted to hop on the machine which is fair enough it's a, it's a gym isn't it it's not a fucking theater for me to film my life but um yeah i didn't manage to get everything but pretty good rundown of basically everything in the plan i think the only thing that i missed was the lying cuffed lateral raises and then also the machine crunch for abs oh, the dust has settled a bit i don't know when that first defeat was or first time probably actually dieting goat. I honestly don't know if I could do any kind of diet without Pepsi Max. I don't know if that's a bad thing to admit. Going to be making meal number three. So my absolute favourite food that as soon as I start dieting I miss instantly and start craving is pizza and I get real cravings for Domino's. So today I'm not going to pretend that it's going to be anywhere near as nice they're sinking my teeth into a Domino's, but I am going to be making some kind of calorie friendly pizzas. So 
basically the only difference is I'm going to use like a tortilla base instead of normal dough, which again, you know, I'm not going to be pretending that this is going to be as good as a Domino's because it's quite evidently not, but hopefully it helps with the cravings. So I am rounding off the day. It is nearly seven o'clock, so in 30 minutes I'm gonna have my last meal slash more of a snack. Um, so my hunger has not been that bad today at all. Um, I don't know why I haven't done anything different, um, but I've really just not been that hungry today, which is nice. <laughs> it's a nice change. Um, so I've actually got quite a few macros left, so I've got enough for a small little bowl of granola with some milk and then I've also still got a little bit of fat left over so I'm gonna have a very very small serving of salted peanuts and I'm ready to round off the day so I've walked my steps, I've eaten my food, well I will have eaten my food by half seven um, and yeah now I'm about to chill and yeah so thank you all for following me around um, this is basically gonna be my life for the next five months just the same thing over and over that's just prep it's very very repetitive um, but I'm so so excited to just go on this journey and tick off this very very long-term goal um, but yeah so hopefully that was interesting thank you all for watching um, and I will see you all in the next one